by Lee Dixon, and we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It is Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Hi, Derek. Well, I'm biased because I'm English through and through. What a special place for a cup final this is. I absolutely love this place, and those players are in for a real treat. What a chance to put your name up in lights. Really looking forward to this. I really am. Well, there are many who regard Bruno Fernandes as the complete footballer. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, virtually everything. Quick feet, quick mind, sees the pass before anybody else. So difficult to stop a player like that. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Harry Maguire plays alongside Victor Lindelof in central defence and potentially a real handful in attack today, Edinson Cavani. Happy to take on the shot. There it is! How about that for starters? Well, what a huge moment that might be for this club. The fans are going absolutely wild. Well, here's the replay, Derek. I love a ball into the box, you know that. It's a beauty. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. And away they go again. What effect will that goal have on Chelsea? We're going to find out. 17, Werner. Oh, it might be. Well, no accuracy at all in terms of the shot unleashed. Well, it's the care and attention, all that work to get in the position and then way, way wide. Scott McTominay. Possession changes hands, the interception there. United come away with it. Fred. And he's in. Well, they can say a big thank you to the goalkeeper. That was inspirational. Well, that's as good as a goal at the other end. Brilliant save from the keeper. Fred, really getting stuck in. James. Reese James. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. And he's lost custody of the ball here. And a throw in forthcoming. And space for the cross. Just too close to the goalkeeper in the end, wasn't it? Yeah, poor technique, really, and the goalkeeper's not troubled. Not the pass he had in mind. Space afforded him. A real opening now. Surely. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, as we look at this again, the keeper's every right to ask where his back line was, but 2v1 in the end, he's thinking now, is he going to pass or go around me? He's got no chance. It's going their way, 2-0. Goal for Manchester United, number seven, Edinson Cavani. Ziyech. Slipshod passing. Well, Manchester United controlling possession here. If you have that much of the ball, you can put pressure on the opposition defence. And they look like they're creaking. That's why they're winning comfortably. Well, rule two have taken up an illegal position only just. Mateo Kovacic. Werner with it now. United have it once again.
Oh, good vision. Cavani! And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. Well, it's always at the discretion of the referee, in this case, opting not to book him. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. And a throw-in it's going to be. Rashford couldn't keep it. And the pass, a good one. And Chelsea looking dangerous. Oh, a fine block. Now can they counter clinically? Will it be sufficiently imaginative? A one-on-one -on -one situation and the goalkeeper prevails in the duel. Advantage is always with the attacking player because he's got the ball, you've got to take the ball off him. He does a brilliant job on that occasion. An example of how to press. Ziyech. Free kick to Chelsea. Well, he'll be thanking his lucky stars that the referee settled for a verbal warning rather than a booking. Well, taking into account all this... Could pull one back here. But no! What a glorious opportunity squandered to get back into this. Well, you sense that had to go in, Derek, if they're going to turn this around. They simply haven't been at the races today. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, away they go again, and there can be no denying it. A huge gulf between the teams in the first half. Will we see a response from Chelsea in the second 45? Conte. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Far from a good pass. Fred. Real chance. Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes and the whites of his outstretched gloves. Great goalkeeping. Well, he's denied a certain goal there. Great reflexes from the keeper. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Mateo Kovacic. Marcos Alonso. N'Golo Conte. It's with Hakim Ziyech. Ziyech. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. And that puts them in position. United finding space on the wing. And a goal to increase their advantage to three. Can they be stopped? Well, here's the replay. Super fast counter-attack football at its best. And what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the goalkeeper absolutely no chance. Fantastic goal. So the action underway once more. And it's beginning to look as though it's a case of how many for United. Mateo Kovacic. And Chelsea have given it away. He's got the right idea with that pass. It might be. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Well, when he's in this sort of mood, he's absolutely unstoppable. What a performance. Well, here it is again, and I wonder how he waltzes past the defender so easily. But you do have to ask questions about the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't keep getting beat at the near post like that.
The ball rolling again in what has been an utterly one-sided match. Number seven, Edinson Cavani. Timo Werner. Rudiger has it. Mount. Wonderful challenge and a throw-in coming up. Time for a change then. Chance to play it in. You've got to say the angle was always against him, Lee. Well, he can't score from there, can he? He should be picking a teammate out. Maguire. Good vision. Can he get onto this? Really important tackle. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting Edinson Cavani really on top of his game in attack, Lee. Well, shot after shot, he sent goal bound. As we can see, keeper must be really sick and tired of him. Keeps picking the ball out of the net as well. And providing width. Shown inside. Can he take the chance? And the post denied him. And on the second half here, and it's almost Lee a case of whatever they've touched has turned to goals. Created. And he's made headway. Surely. And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. Well, I'm sure you want to see this again. Where is everybody? The defenders, nowhere to be seen. It's an open goal. Slightly different vantage point in terms of the goal that was scored. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Number seven, Edinson Cavani. A fine reading of the situation. Fred. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponents. Werner. Can they hit on the break? Throw in to Manchester United. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Coming onto the pitch, number five, Georgina. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. Rudiger. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Into the advanced position. And there's the feed into the box. It comes to nothing in the end. And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware and that little medal that goes round your neck might seem small now, but you'll look back at that, show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Yeah, it's been a long old road to get to this point. 
They're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night, I think. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And this is really special, getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup. That's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. Well, all that hard work along the...